Look, look who's here. <laughs> Hi, I have a little button here that my granddaughter gave me. She just turned 11. It says, best grandpa ever. So that's how much life means. It's wonderful. <laughs> Hi, my name is Skip Tremblay. I'm 76 years old. In July of 21, I underwent the TAVR procedure. That's T-A-V-R procedure to replace my aortic valve in my heart by Drs. Walsh and Heslop. Nice to see you. Good, sir. How are you? Best grandpa ever. How are you? Yeah. So Skip's case was not uncommon for a patient with severe valvular heart disease. He underwent a CT scan so we could plan the procedure. We assessed the arteries of his leg to make sure it could accommodate the valve. We looked at his heart valve to determine the right size uh, for the type of valve prosthesis that we typically use. And then we went ahead and scheduled the procedure. And when they told me that you have to go downstairs and see the TAVR team, I said, what is a TAVR team? And so I came downstairs and he had told me exactly what I had and how bad my valve was. I figured if my heart was that bad, they were going to have to split my chest open and go do it the hard way. And I didn't want that. I wasn't looking forward to that at all. And then when I was given this opportunity, I jumped at it. The valve went perfectly as usual, took about 30 minutes. He was up walking within four hours and went home the next day. Big deep breath. I can sum it up this way, I think. I arrived here at the hospital at 7 a.m. At 10 a.m. they wheeled me into the procedure room. At noon I came out and at 6.45 in the evening I was sitting up in bed having dinner. Now, that's a normal dinner, not a restricted diet. That's incredible, absolutely incredible. Fortunately, that's a very common experience with our patients. Most of our patients go home either the same day or the next day, and they have almost immediate relief of their symptoms. They're breathing better initially, their face looks more red because their, their body's getting more blood flow, and they have a significant improvement in the quality of their life, which is really gratifying as a physician, especially since we can do it minimally invasive with minimal recovery and minimal risk of complications. Saved my life? Absolutely they saved my life. You know, when I was a kid, you see about Superman on TV. We've got two of them here, St. Al's. Both these doctors are fantastic. The team that works with them in the office and in the procedure room are fantastic. And if you need it, get it done. Higher, higher! I had no idea what a murmur was at one point in time. I had no idea how dangerous it was or what the outcome could be. We're going to follow him every year with an ultrasound of his heart to make sure the valve's functioning well. He'll need other kind of routine care in terms of blood pressure management and other things, but for the most part, he is cured from his severe valvular heart disease now. I did it. I would do it again. Hopefully I don't have to, but here we are in 2023, and I'm doing great.